quiet. We have to be careful not to wake them up, or the whole plan will go awry. Carry them gently and without any unnecessary shaking. No unnecessary movements. All in sync. Come on, brothers. We are almost home. We have only a little more to carry. Now we will come and we can finally rest. Be patient a little longer. The main thing is to stay as careful as you are. Oh no, we must hurry. The red one is starting to wake up. Dig a hole for him and tie up the green one. What? What's going on? Where am I? How did I get here? For what? Who are you? Why am I in the pit? Let me out of here! Shut up! Stop yelling or I'll beat you! Don't ask questions and stay in the pit! No! I will not be silent! Let me out of here, you diamond midget! Take that! You're too loud! No one's going to let you out anyway, so sit quietly and don't piss me off! Somebody help! Mikey and I have been kidnapped by diamond midgets! Help! Let me out of here! Shut up! Here! You'd better eat the earth! Put it in your mouth so you don't yell. What? No, I won't eat the ground. Give me some normal food. What kind of nonsense is this? If you don't want to eat the ground, I'll just bury you. At least that way you won't be so loud. Uh, no, I don't want to sit in a hole underground. Let me out. I'll fight, and I'm stronger than you. Don't talk nonsense. Just don't say anything. There's nothing you can do. Ha, I escaped. What? What kind of micro town is this? Who are you people? Why did you kidnap us? Just leave us alone! Come here! Stop running away! Get back in the hole, or else you'll be in trouble! No! I'll save Mikey! The two of us will beat you! Mikey, get up and help me fight these midgets! I can't! They've tied me up and I can't move! Help me! It's not working! That midget is in my way! I'll come back and save you! That's right! I've got a smoke grenade! Those midgets are so small, it'll be a real fog for them! It'll definitely help me escape them! Uh, that's it! Get a grenade, you little diamond men! Not as brave as they used to be, huh? Phew! Running away from them was a lot harder than I thought! But, they got what they deserved, and hopefully, they'll be walking around in that smoke for a long time to come! But now I have to figure out how to rescue Mikey, because I can't leave him in the hands of these midgets! There's some house around here. Hopefully someone there can help me deal with these diamond midgets. I need to check who lives there, and maybe there are things there that will help me in battle. I hope whoever lives here knows what to do and how to fight these diamond men, otherwise I don't know what to do. Such a beautiful house! I hope whoever lives here can help me. Hello? Is anyone there? Get out of here, you disgusting midgets. Try to get in there and you're dead. You'll be sorry you were ever born. Hey, I'm just an ordinary man. Those diamond men kidnapped me and my friend, but I managed to escape. Wait, I'm really just a normal person. Don't shoot, I don't want to hurt you. See, I'm not doing anything wrong. I just want you to help me defeat those diamond men. They kidnapped my friend, and I want to save him. What? Are you really a regular person? You're not with them? Then I'm sorry for shooting you. Those diamond midgets have been bothering me all my life. I lost an arm and a leg fighting them. Wow! But you're so rich! You have so many diamond blocks! That's because I'm killing these diamond midgets. And they want my diamonds. But there's no way I'm giving them up. Here, take this chest of gear to fight against these midgets. How cool! Thank you! With this gear, I can easily save Mikey and defeat those midgets. Ha, you're so cocky. Do you even know how to use it? You'll get hurt. What? Of course I can do anything. I can do anything. Besides, my friend's in there. I have to save him. They've tied him up and they're probably beating him now. So we have to hurry up and get him out of there. All right, let's hurry up and go save your friend together. Do you have any plan? A plan? No. I thought we were just going to go in there and beat everybody. Isn't that the plan? Well, I also have some smoke grenades that might help us. What? No. There's no way we can beat them that way. We'll do it my way. We'll make traps for them. Here, I've got water. We'll dig holes with water and stakes. Then we'll trap them in there. And while they're trying to get out, we'll save your friend. Okay, I like your idea better. I'll throw them a smoke grenade. And while they can't see anything, we'll dig traps. All right, that's a good idea. Now let's dig a hole fast. We have to do it as fast as we can before they realize what's happening. I'm digging! I'm digging as fast as I can! Hopefully our plan will work and we can save my friend Mikey! Our plan will definitely work and we will definitely save your friend. The main thing is to do it right. 
We can't go wrong anywhere. Okay, we've almost dug a deep hole. Just a little more and we can climb out. That's enough. Let's get out of there and fill that hole with water. Great! I hope this works. Get a bucket of water. We're gonna fill this hole with water. All right. A big water pit like this will definitely work on those little midgets. They won't be able to get out of here, and we can easily rescue your friend from their captivity. Nice! But we gotta hurry. I'm running out of smoke grenades, which means it won't be long before those midgets realize what's going on here and come to deal with us. And we still have to dig a hole with spikes in it. But there's not much time left. They'll be here any minute. So far, we have plenty of time, and they are still in the smoke screen, which means we are still safe. So we need to dig a hole and get out of here. Yes, now I'm almost done. I'm already installing the spikes, but I have one last smoke grenade left, so I need to finish as soon as possible. That's okay. The water pit is already almost completely filled, and you'd sooner cover the spike pit with fake grass, and the deed can be considered done. I almost covered the hole with grass. They'll be surprised when they fall into that trap. Yeah, that should definitely work for them. There's no way they can beat us. Great! The pit is closed, but I'm out of smoke grenades, which means we have to hide before they see us. Now we'll hide, and when they come to their senses, we'll lure them outside right into these traps. Let's hurry up and hide. We need to dig a small shelter not far from here and wait in it for a while. I think this place is perfect. Let's dig a shelter here before the midgets see us. They'll come to their senses soon enough. Great plan. So far, everything's going perfectly and we're doing well. We hide here and wait for the right moment. Great, enough time has passed and they don't seem to suspect anything. Stay here and I'll go and trap them. Hey you, I'm here, look at me, you little boogers. Come here and try to do something to me. I'm back to fight you. Come at me and let's see who can beat who. All right, the plan worked. You fell into my trap, you fools. So stupidly trapped, you were so easy to fool. Cool, but there's no rush. Not everyone is here, so we still need to be careful or there will be a lot more of these evil midgets coming and we won't have as much fun. Okay, but first I'm gonna bury them the way they wanted to bury me. It's revenge for what they did. It's the right and honorable thing to do. Okay, let's bury them. But then we need to proceed just as carefully to save your friend. Yes, you're right. There are still plenty of them and they're still running around out there, but we need to get my friend Mikey out somehow. Let's dig under him and get him out of here. All right, let's do it. We'll free him through the dig, and then we'll run to my house, and if they come after us, we'll fight them off. Great! Then I start digging a dugout to save my friend Mikey. He's probably tired of lying tied up by now. I hope they didn't hurt him. Cool, just don't accidentally release the diamond midgets we catch, or they'll raise the alarm. Okay, I'll be careful, because my friend's life is at stake, and I really want to save him. If you want to save your friends, learn to be a badass like me. Look. I'm breaking a rock with my bare hands. I unfortunately can't break rocks with my bare hands, only with a pickaxe, but that won't stop me from saving my friend. Here we are, we're close. Good, then let's get him out of here and run back to my house. Then we'll figure out what to do next. Let's go. All right, let's get him out and run. I'm ready. <laughs> Great, we stole Mikey from those nasty diamond men. How cool. Thanks, diamond man hunter. You've been a great help. Let's take him home and wait for him to wake up. But we have to hurry. I'm afraid those evil little men might chase us. That wouldn't be cool at all. How creepy. Hmm. Is this the diamond's revenge for mining them too often? What do you think, big guy? Personally, I don't think anything. I only mine diamonds in battles with these little monsters. And I will say this, they started first. Yeah, I broke the window so Mikey could get through the doorway. It's not a big deal though. If we dropped him, we'd blame the bruises on the diamond men. Yeah, I can see you're not exactly the best of friends, but what can you do? We don't choose our friends. The important thing is that you did worry about your friend and went to save him. Exactly. I believe that after this rescue, Mikey will owe me his whole life. <laughs> Oh, Mikey, you're awake now? What a blessing. It's good to see you in good health. Thank you for your help, weird stranger with one eye. I'm not one-eyed. I just keep my other eye in my pocket as a backup. Huh? That's really weird, but thanks anyway. Let's go get revenge on all those obnoxious little people. I totally agree. Let's go get revenge on those nasty diamond men. We need to show them who's boss. Hey, Mikey, don't steal that tough guy's diamonds. Let him take it. It's not real blocks anyway. It's decorative glass. 
All right, let's go, Mikey. Thank you again, Mr. Diamond Man Hunter. You really helped us out, especially when you got that stupid Mikey out of there. You didn't have to take me away. I slept so well in there. Then we'll be right back and I'll tie you up and put you back where you belong. Oh, come on, I was just kidding. Don't overreact. All right. Okay, Mikey, we're approaching their village. Be on your guard. These little guys are very aggressive and quite dangerous. Not since they stole me. I'll be the most dangerous today. Let them be afraid. All right, suit yourself. Hello, little ones. How are you doing? There's a lot of you. Be careful, Mikey. There's a lot of them. You've got to be very careful. Hey, why don't they pay attention to us? I want to fight them. JJ, do something. Hey, Diamond Men. I'm going to take you all and crush you, and I'm going to walk around laughing at your small stature. <laughs> it worked, JJ. Great, you're a genius. <laughs> oh, I overdid it. Leave me alone, you little freaks. I don't want to mess with you. You're scaring me. All right, everybody follow me. I know how to deal with you. Come on, let's go. What's your idea, JJ? Are you trying to outsmart them somehow? Yeah, well, we've been building traps with that almost one-eyed guy. I'm planning on using one of them right now. So yeah, follow me, you silly little diamond men. <laughs> yes, look at the gorgeous pond here. I'm sure you want to swim in it very badly. So come on, jump in quickly. Otherwise, I'll be swimming here alone. All right, I think we got him, Mikey. You're up, come on. Great idea, JJ. There's just one final touch missing. I hear you, come on, Fire Mikey. Make it beautiful. Let's stop those diamond babies. Hurry up, what are we waiting for? They're going to run away. I don't want to run around with them again. I was tired the first time. All right, the lava idea is great. Come on, Mikey. Burn them. I don't want to see those little freaks again. They shoot like popcorn in a microwave. I love it. Maybe after we loot their village, we can go get some popcorn. I want popcorn. I want popcorn so bad. Salted or caramelized or even something else. I don't know. I don't know anything, JJ. But we have to have popcorn tonight. No, Mikey, stop. Don't blow it up yet. They must have tons of diamonds hidden in the village. Let's put on all their treasures first and then we'll break in. All right, fine. But as soon as we find the so-called treasure, I'll blow it up. Do we have a deal? Yeah, sure. I'll even help you blow the place up later. Come on, Mikey, dig. Why do I have to do this alone? I think there's something there. Just dig a little deeper. Whoa. Wow. There's a whole chest here. We should look into it and find out what the little diamond men have decided to hide underground. They're diamond blocks, Mikey. Catch them. Take as many as you can fit in your pockets. Oh yeah, you're a turtle, you don't wear pants. Where'd you get your pockets from? Never mind, take it all. You can't leave them here in case someone else finds them and takes them. All right, then let's hide them here. Great idea, Mikey. Then we'll bury them here and come back for them when we run out of diamonds. For now, we can close everything up and go back to our new one-eyed friend. Yes, the one who's kind of a diamond manhunter. We'll have to share it with him. Why'd you draw your sword, Mikey? What are you trying to do, attack me? Please turn around, JJ. Who are you, big guys? Did you live in this village too? I doubt you lived here, but if you've come to avenge your lesser brothers, you've made a very rash decision because we're in charge of this village now. JJ and Mikey. Oh no, I changed my mind. I think you guys are in charge. Mikey, help me. I can't handle them alone. Why are you crying, Mikey? What happened to you again? We won't beat them, they're too big. We definitely won't beat them. Don't get discouraged, Mikey. Come on, fight. We have to fight if we want to walk out of here victorious. Why don't we just call the hunter? I think he's tough enough to take on these giants. He's helped us enough today. I don't want to bother him anymore. That's why we have to deal with the big guys ourselves. Otherwise, we're no worse than the little people who come running at you in droves. All right, I got a plan. Distract the big guy. That's better. Hey, big guy. Look what I got! What are you standing there for? Follow me! I'm so nasty I need to be caught. So come on, chase me, chase me! All right, you can leave, as long as that giant stays here. All right, move out, move out! Okay, blowing up the last giant was a great idea, Mikey. You're really cool! Now we can go to the Diamond Man Hunter and brag to him that we destroyed that nasty village and even took out two real giants. What do you think, Mikey? I think it's a cool idea. Uh -huh. That one-eyed guy's gonna be so happy with us. I mean, now he can retire. No, really, I don't think that old man ever rested. 
Hello, our new friend. We beat them all. We destroyed the whole village and got a bunch of diamonds, so here you go. You deserve it. We're very grateful to you, so you can have it all. Thank you again for helping me and Mikey out. In return, we helped you hunt down those nasty little creatures and even defeated two of their giants. Yep, yep, yep. What are you doing, Mikey? Are you out of your mind? You're gonna kill your savior. You're a fool, Mikey. Put a bucket on your head if you're so stupid. Please forgive him, Mr. Hunter. We'll fix it now, honestly. Uh -huh. Mikey and I have no idea where they came from, but the fact that we defeated them, I think deserves credit. Don't you think so? That's right. But what would we do without you, Mr. Hunter? Could I have saved that stupid Mikey without your help? Could Mikey and I have defeated those nasty little men without your traps? That's right. So thank you very much again. And here's a bunch of diamonds to thank you. Mikey, you again? Are you kidding me? Stop it. Let's at least say a proper goodbye and then you can do whatever you want, okay? Do we have a deal? Okay, excuse us, Mr. Hunter, bye-bye. 